Hi guys, I want to introduce you to the new LRF Light Range Fishing Kits. So let's start off with the Light Range Fishing Mini Sand Eel Kit. It combines the Pell Tail Sand Eel's great vibrating action with the darting action of the Sand Eel Slug on the same micro Sand Eel head. These lures will catch just about any predator fish in both freshwater and saltwater. You got five perfect colors in two models and five jig heads. Here guys, you have it, the 25 piece mini sand eel kit. So onto the LRF mini casting jigs, the Psycho Spread. The LRF Psycho Spread kit are mini casting jigs with a perfect vibrating flashing action on retrieve and the perfect roll on spin stop, big flash and slide out on jigging. You will cast a mile with these lures. They got a wide gape single hook for great hookup rate and easy catch and release. This kit comes in three different sizes, five, eight and 10 grams. And you got three colors that has been proven to be successful. The sardine, the white glow and the pink flash. You can catch rainbow trout, sea run brown trout, perch, just about any fish you want to catch, both in salt water and in fresh water. If you want to know more about the LRF kits from Savage Gear, be sure to visit savagegear.com. There's a new lure on the way that is based on one of the most important prey fish for many freshwater predators. The 3D Bleak Glide Swimmer. Hey folks, I want to introduce you to a new lure from Savage Gear. It's called the 3D Bleak Glide Swimmer. And I wanted to make a very distinct action that imitates the real action of a bleak. So first I caught some real bleak right here behind me and I made a scan of a real bleak. Uh, and the profile as you can see in the fins and the detail is just like a real bleak. The distinct action is actually uh, made from this restricted V-joint. As you can see it has a a V-joint. That means on a steady retrieve the lure will swim to the side till it reaches a certain point and then it will change the angle and go to the other side like that. And it won't be a very soft swimming action, it will actually be like a bleak. The escape pattern, the movement pattern of a bleak. When you twitch or jerk the rod tip the lure will shoot out to the side and you can make a very wide glide if you work the lure right. So the 3D bleak glide swimmer a great addition to the Savage Gear range. The restricted V-joint in combination with the unique body shape give the most enticing glide swimming action. This is a lure that's very easy to use. On a steady retrieve you will have big side to side swim. But if you jerk it you will have a superb side flash action. Uh, as you can see the tail is made from semi-soft uh, PVC um, in this way we avoid when the fish attack it or you hit a rock or a branch that the tail, the very thin tail breaks off. And it also uh, gives a very realistic look in the water. So the 3D Bleak Glide Swimmer. Great action, very easy to use, fished on a bait caster or a spinning rod, everybody can use the 3D Bleak Glide Swimmer. Bam! The erratic and side shifting action that is tuned to perfection will make even the most wary predator attack this lure again and again. It's deadly for pike, perch, bass and uh, yeah, you name it. The Savage Gear 3D Bleak Glide Swimmer. Hi folks, I want to introduce you to the new Savage Gear Sand Eel Darter. This stunningly unique lure is a supernatural imitation of the sand eels, sand eels being the favorite snack of many predators. These soft bodied lures has the most fantastic swimming action, a true innovative and a very effective and easy fish lure. It's available in two sizes, the 40 gram 20 centimeter and the 46 gram 20 centimeter. This is Savage Gear's first 100% saltwater orientated lures. They are designed mainly for the new modern way of vertical fishing, but they are proven deadly as swim baits 
and even for trolling. The swim in action of these lures are so amazing that you have to see it to believe it. If you want to know more about these lures, be sure to visit savagegear.com. The 3D Crayfish. So real, it will amaze you. Hey folks, let me show you how to rig up the 3D Crayfish. We got three different base accessories for the Crayfish. We got an extreme wide gape hook with a corkscrew. We got a stand-up jig head. And we got this stealth spike. So for the extreme white gap hook with a corkscrew it's really simple all you have to do is just take your crayfish and screw that on right in the center of the tail and that's a very very common way to rig up these soft lures with an extreme white gap hook so just like that you can see make sure that it comes off the center of the base of the tail like so and then you take your crayfish and you put the hook like that up through the chest and you have it coming up on the back side like that. If you're fishing in cover it's a good idea to just pinch down the the hook like so so the hook tip is just hidden in the skin here. If you're fishing a little bit more open uh, especially for pike and other fish don't bite as hard as the bass it's a good idea to leave the the hook tip exposed like that. So that's how you rig it up on the extreme white cable hook, white cable hook with a corkscrew. Very, very simple. Second way, on the stand-up jig head, you can see here, you wanna have that tail come up and cover, so the hook must come up just under the hook shield. So again, it's a good thing to try to hook it in the center of the tail part like that. And let the hook tip come out just before the back shield like so just take the soft lure and come up like so so that's perfectly rigged up with the stand up jig head right there then the last one is the stealth spike and the stealth spike is like this wire frame here the wire frame you punch in just under the chest there you punch it through and it comes out all the way out in the nose of the crayfish. You have to push it through like that so it sticks out right there. Then that little spike here, you punch that into the tail section right in the middle so that you actually create this like an airplane, like a plane that will slide away from you. Then you take your little hook, it comes together with a spike and you actually run that through the nose and the little metal bow. This way you cannot pull the bait off. You can see the, the metal bow is sticking out right there. So you take the hook through here. And then you just tie your line on to that hook like so. By scanning a real crayfish and combining it with careful study of the movement and escape pattern of the real thing, Savage Gear has been able to create a crayfish that look and swim as real as possible, irresistible to even the wariest predator fish. Air-filled claws will not only aid in natural underwater movement when the craw is rigged forward, but also give a defensive posture when the craw is fished on a stand-up jig head and will make micro-movements even at the tiniest movement and water current. The air-filled head cavity makes yeah. the craw float, so it can be fished on a weighted weedless hook over heavy mats and lily pads and then passed in openings for a slow enticing fall into the strike zone, just like the real thing.
Hi guys, I want to introduce you to the new Savage Gear 3D Herring Big Shad. And it's big. We have combined 3D scanning and 3D modeling in the quest to produce the perfect lure in both appearance and swimming action. And by scanning a real fish and combining it with the geometrical shapes, we have created this lure that look and swim as close to the real thing as possible. The 3D herring Big Shad is a perfect imitation of the Atlantic herring, one of the most important prey fish for the Nordic big game species like halibut, giant cod and coldfish. It has got a superb rocking and lively swimming action, both on steady retrieve and on the drop. And it produces a perfect escape pattern, tricking even the most wary predator fish to attack. This is perfect for jigging and trolling the biggest monsters down there. It got a soft, durable PVC body, a very detailed head, it got this nylon mesh reinforced tail bridge and the big fish Kevlar stinger. It comes in two different sizes, the 560 grams with one head, one body and one stinger and the 300 grams with two bodies, one stinger and one head. If you want to know more about these lures, be sure to visit savagegear.com. Thanks to 3D scanning and careful studies of the real shrimp, Savage Gear has been able to create the 3D Manic Shrimp, a lure that look and swim as real as possible. The exaggerated cylindrical front legs will make the shrimp walk with a typical pulsating movement. The antennas and rear legs adds a very realistic secondary action to the lure. One or more pairs of the front legs can be pulled off to actually change the action. It comes in six colors, dark olive, Magic Brown, Krill Pink, Blue Pearl Sand, Golden and Glow. This lure has multiple rigging options such as Jig Head, Drop Shot, Carolina, Bombarda and more. It is superb for both freshwater and saltwater species. So let's welcome the Savage Gear 3D Manic Shrimp. Hi guys, I want to introduce you to the new 10 cm Sand Eel and Slug Kit. Well, this is the very successful Savage Sand Eel in smaller size combined with a Sand Eel Slug to create a perfect little kit for light range fishing for multiple species. The pale tail swims and rocks with a most lifelike vibrating escape pattern on the drop. The darting slug darts from side to side on the twitches and will provoke even the wariest predator to attack. The combination of the two lures in this six piece pack makes a very versatile kit in both current and still water, fresh and salt water. If you want to know more about this kit, be sure to visit savagegear.com. Hey guys, let me introduce you to the 3D Trout Shad from Savage Gear. We wanted to create the most realistic trout swim bait out there. So we started off with a real thing. So this 11 inch trout, scanned it and get all the perfect details into the file. And we added the perfect size paddle tail to give it this great rocking realistic swimming action. And we made three sizes to begin with. So we got a 20.5 centimeter so that's just over 8 inches and then we have 17 centimeters so that's 6.5 or 7 inches and then we got the smaller size a little small with the par markings at 12.5 centimeters or 5 inches all of them are uh, balanced so they have this great rocking action and on the drop they actually have an escape pattern like a real trout so they don't fall in a spiral they actually swim when you give them free line or on the drop Okay guys, so we're here on a big lake. Uh, this is a perfect place to fish with the new 3D trout. Uh, what we're going to do here is we're going to troll these trout babies behind the paravans pelagically. So we're going to fish them relatively high over deep water and along the edges and see if we can locate where the pike is. So let's go do it. The little golden albino trout just got hammered. Uh, 
that's what we want to see. Big white belly down there. Okay, here we go. So that's the great thing about fishing pelagic with these trout. When you get a bite, very often, it's a good fish. Oh, it's a big sander. I'll tell you what, it's a big ass sander. Just a big sander that took that. Yes, sir. Ha, right on the trout. That's a good sander right there. Oh. Did he take that trout or what? Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! Right there. Big sander on the 3D trout. So the big sanders, or the sanders in general, I don't release them uh, just like a pike. I want them to go down deep so they sort of decompress. So I'm just gonna let it go. There you see, just decompressed like that, and it's off. The Savage Gear 3D Trout Shad is a spitting image of a real trout based on 3D scanning. Superb rocking and lively swimming action, both on steady retrieve and on the drop, produces the perfect escape pattern, tricking even the most wary predator fish to attack. Just as I turned the boat, the outside paravan, the inside paravan here with a albino trout just got hammered on the drop. It doesn't feel like a big fish though. Let's see what this is. Right on the 3D trout. Okay, here we go. So let's see if he, if he nailed that trout because it certainly looks like it. I can't see anything of that lure. And since this is no monster, I'm not gonna use a net on him. I'm just gonna take him over the, over the back here. Got it, right there. So, do they like the trout? I think so. 3D trout, baby. Bang. By scanning a real fish and combining it with geometrical shapes, Savage Gear has been able to create lures that look and swim as close to the real thing as possible. It has an integrated non-lead weight, big rolled paddle tail, and is superb for both casting and trolling. Just listen to what Oliver has to say. Hey guys, this is Oliver Nye of Big Bass Dreams, Akuma Fishing, and Savage Gear. Here to uh, show you guys a little bit about the new Savage Gear Reel Trout. For the price, you can't beat it. We got two sizes here. We got a prototype 8 inch. A little bit bigger profile and the 7 inch which you've seen in stores already. Now this bait swims really good at really low speeds. I throw the 7 inch on a C3 711 Heavy with a Citrix 350 low profile Akuma reel. And on the 8 inch I like the C3 Extra Heavy with the Komodo 350 low profile reel. And I fish them both on 20 or 25 pound mono. Right. On the savage gear, baby. Nice. Oh, that's a good one. On the savage gear, real trout. Oh, man, look at that. Look at that, boys and girls. Look at how they eat this thing. It's a solid fish. Savage gear, baby. Just as we turned, big bite on the trout again, of course, right there on the golden trout. Wow, look at this, so beautiful. Totally perfect colored fish. Wow. So that's a true pelagic pike right there. Yes. Woo. Right on the trout. Bam. Look at the colors on that. See those pelagic pike? They just hang mid-water. So this one took the lure probably three, four meter down over 22 meters of water. Just sit. Bam! Right on! 3D trap.
Hi guys, I want to introduce you to the Manic Prey. The Manic Prey, it's a great long casting all round lure with the most enticing Manic roll and flash, even at low speeds. It got a heavy duty ABS body with a through going wire to hold up for even the most brutal predator fish. It got a superb finish and detail, great for most predator fish. One really great feature with these lures are the iron cylinder long cast system. It will ensure you to get the most distance out of every cast, regardless of wind or any other circumstances. It comes in five different sizes, the 7 cm, 15 grams, the 9 cm, 17 grams, 11.5 cm, 22 grams, 14.5 cm, 33 grams, and 16.5 cm, 55 grams. If you want to know more about these lures, be sure to visit savagegear.com.